Helen Dunmore's novel, The Siege, is set in Leningrad during the Second World War, a city that was subjected to a brutal and protracted siege by Nazi forces. The novel explores the impact of the siege on the lives of the people living in the city and how they struggled to survive against overwhelming odds. The novel is a powerful testament to the human spirit and resilience in the face of unimaginable adversity. One of the main themes of the novel is the way in which people are forced to come together in times of crisis. As the siege drags on, people from all walks of life are forced to live and work together in cramped and dangerous conditions. The novel explores how people from different backgrounds and social classes learn to work together and support one another in order to survive. For example, Anna, a privileged university student, is forced to share a small apartment with her father and brother and she learns to adapt to the harsh realities of life in Leningrad. Similarly, Marina, a talented musician, is forced to work in a factory alongside people she would never have interacted with in normal circumstances. Through their experiences, Dunmore shows how people can overcome their differences and work together in times of crisis. Another important theme of the novel is the psychological impact of the siege on the people of Leningrad. The constant threat of starvation and the daily horrors of living in a city under siege take a toll on the mental health of the characters. For example, Anna's brother Kolya becomes increasingly erratic and paranoid as the siege continues, and Marina experiences vivid nightmares and flashbacks. Dunmore shows how the characters use different coping mechanisms to deal with the stress and trauma of the siege, from poetry and music to alcohol and drugs. Through the characters' experiences, Dunmore highlights the devastating impact that war can have on people's mental health. Dunmore's use of imagery and symbolism is also noteworthy. The novel is full of vivid descriptions of the city under siege, from the relentless cold to the ever-present threat of hunger and death. Dunmore uses these images to create a sense of claustrophobia and despair, as the characters are trapped in a city that seems to offer no hope of escape. For example, in one memorable scene, Anna and her father visit the zoo, only to find that the animals have been slaughtered and eaten by the starving population. This scene is a powerful symbol of the desperation and brutality of life in Leningrad under siege. In addition to its powerful imagery, the siege is also notable for its use of multiple perspectives. The novel is told from the perspectives of several different characters, each with their own unique experiences and insights. This allows Dunmore to explore the impact of the siege on a variety of people, from the wealthy intelligentsia to the working-class factory workers. Through these different perspectives, Dunmore shows how the siege affected people from all walks of life and highlights the universality of human suffering in times of war. Overall, The Siege is a powerful and moving novel that explores the impact of war on the human psyche. Through its vivid imagery, multiple perspectives, and nuanced exploration of themes such as resilience, community, and mental health, the novel offers a poignant and timely reminder of the devastating toll that war can take on individuals and societies. Dunmore's writing is both beautiful and brutal, capturing the horror and humanity of the Siege of Leningrad with unparalleled skill and sensitivity.